Most of the times, it's you having to go up to the girl at their mercy and experiencing the rejection. And, and, and don't get me wrong, while this is an effective way of meeting and, 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 and talking to new girls, don't forget what your sensei, your brother has taught you. Clothing, it's like a weapon, bro. I'm gonna need you to use it. See, some people like to use clothing as an art form to express their creativity and their artistic talents. That's cool and all. Me? I like to use it to send messages. I prefer to mold an encrypted message with my clothing and that is that you are an irresistible dude better than that schmuck that she's dating right now. Today, boys, I'm gonna show you how to use clothing to get girls' attention. Let's hop into it. Number one, understanding the psychology of color. Not only does every color send a specific message, they also reflect differently on different skin tone colors. So it can get a little bit complicated, especially once you start implementing a lot of colors, which is why your blue, your black, your gray, your white, these have to be your go-to. See, these are hues that work with almost every skin tone color, and they're also colors women love. See, since they're removed of all sort of vibrancy and of color, they're more serious, they're more dapper, they're more mysterious. That leads them to notice you. Two, expose strategic areas. This is tactical. See, there are strategic areas in the body that women notice, that they pick up on. These are the areas that you wanna expose. I've always talked about the chest, adding a necklace, showing it off. That's strategic. I've talked about the forearms. This is, a, this is a smart move. See, women love thick forms, especially if they're veiny and they're strong. You wanna expose these, these look good. Another one that I rarely talk about, but this one's a powerhouse, it's the quads. See, quads are my favorite. The quads are one of those areas that most men don't work out. See, most men have big biceps because that's all they go do, curls. But most men don't have good legs. When you have sexy quads and you expose them, yo, the immediate thought of athleticism will run through that girl's head. Yo, guys, uh, honestly, like, a wand is like, so This is exactly why with our new Essentials collection that's dropping June, Fifth, I designed all the shorts to be quad enhancing. You heard me right. See, this is the thing that when I get into my designing process, I not only design clothing that looks good, that's in style, that's in trend, that has the right color palette. I design clothing that makes you look good, that shapes your body like it should so it looks more athletic, it looks more powerful. That's exactly what we did with this new collection. Boys, matter of fact, tomorrow I am leaving to Peru. I am going to be 20,000 feet in elevation shooting this new collection which I promise you it is the greatest thing that we have ever done and we don't cut corners yes we are flying like 4,000 miles yes we are gonna risk our lives experience elevation sickness in the whole nine we're taking a whole crew of about 10 people just to make this campaign happen just so I can bring to fruition the vision that we had for this collection boys no corners are ever cut with this collection and every single time we just up the ante this one it was inspired by the rainbow mountain in Peru the color palette is sick it's like this dusty pastel colors the entire palette if you don't get one of every single color you're gonna miss out because not only is it gonna sell out these colors will never come back these are the most unique colors you'll ever find because well they don't exist we actually had to make them from scratch copying the natural colors that this mountain formed yo this is the sickest collection and one of the craziest pieces I call it the scuba suit. I don't know exactly yet what I want to call it, but it's basically your summer sweatsuit where we created this, the top, which is the shirt, which is a mock neck box fit shirt. It's that perfect boxy fit that everybody's looking for. And it has that mock neck that's highly in trend right now, which kind of elevates the feel of the t-shirt, but it's made out of, out of this kind of like thick, spongy scuba material. It's a tri-blend material. When I tell you this was the hardest fabric to source, you just have no idea the logistics that went behind this fabric. Well, we also made the shorts out of the same material. So it creates an entire suit, which is perfect for summer. But what I want you to focus on here, look at that fit, bro. Look at that fit. I do not lie to you when I tell you that we invest, bro, the amount of effort that we invest on fit, you have no idea. And this is why the quad enhancing fit is so perfect on these shorts. Boys, June 5th, I want you right now, I'm telling you early, look, put a reminder on your phone, 10 a.m., June 5th, you need to be there. This new summer collection, it's gonna be the greatest thing we've ever dropped. I don't want you to miss. Number three, make sure it's wrinkle-free. This sounds so simple, but you wanna know 
what a girl thinks when she sees you in wrinkled clothing, this man probably still lives with his mom. He's still a boy. When you start ironing your clothes, everything is crispy. Everything fits right. These are subtle cues, subtle messages you're sending to everybody that you're clean cut, that you're crisp, that you take care of yourself. That level of responsibility and maturity, yeah. Girls peep that. Number four, leather shoes. Leather shoes are grown man moves. Leather shoes are power moves. See, yo, women are used to seeing dudes in Air Force Ones and in Jordans and in sneakers and in Yeezys. And by the way, those are fine in their context. But every now and then, I want you to break it up. I want you to throw a pair of leather loafers or maybe leather lace-ups. Dress it up just a little bit. Look, you need to understand, you don't need to wear a suit to throw that on. You can throw that on with some casual trousers and a polo shirt or a t-shirt tucked in. You have a casual look that's elevated. And do this once, try to do this once a month. Kind of warm up into these outfits and I'm telling you, you have no idea the power that that this holds in a woman's head. When they see you, they're gonna think, yo, this dude's important, this dude is high status. Number five. Stay cool. And I'm not talking about like cool, I'm talking about stay cool. Never overdress. See, you're just gonna look like a tryhard. Anybody too wound up will just look all uncomfortable and stiff. No, 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 no. I never want you to overdress and I want you to dress comfortable in clothing that you feel confident in. See, when you dress cool and confident, that's how you're gonna carry yourself, just cool and laid back. And that type of, that type of vibe, yo, any woman's gonna wanna click with. And when it comes to overdressing, honestly, just let her take the role. You keep it simple. Keep it with the neutral colors that I talked about. Keep it with the right fits that I talk about. Yo, <laughs> wear essentials. I, keep, I make it easy for you, but let her take the role of overdressing. Let her take all that effort. Which rolls on to number six. I want you to develop a uniform. Look, sometimes doing too much can be stressful. Having to learn or having to figure out what to wear every morning can be stressful. So anytime you find a certain piece, whether it's a black t-shirt, like our, <laughs> our bamboo tees that freaking sell out like this is the product that always sells out first. If you find a tee, like our bamboo tees that fit so well, yo, go and buy five or six of them because you already know you're gonna wear that every single day. If you find a pair of jeans that fit perfectly, you just love how they fit, buy two or three of those because you know you're gonna wear those every single day. Start, build, start crafting that uniform out of pieces that you know fit good, make you look good, and then you don't have to worry about it. Every morning, you wear your daily uniform, shoot. Some of the richest men in the world do this, and that's for a reason. It's efficient, and you know you'll look good every day. And that's basically it for this week's video, guys. Those are six tricks you can do to get women to notice you with your clothing. If you guys liked this video and found it informative, don't forget to drop us a like down below. Also, boys, don't forget our new Essentials launch drops June 5th, and I don't want you to miss it. That's it for me today. See you next time.